Hi everybody and welcome to True Wants, where here we try to help you decide if it's going to change from a want to a need. Now we film live here with no edits and I prepare and do as much research as I can ahead of time because as soon as I know something I want you to know it too so that we can be in the know together. But if you're interested we have informative videos on this channel so simply hit that subscribe button it's free and then also there's that bell that will give you a new video notification and don't forget to press that thumbs up that will help this video to grow and hopefully we'll also find others who enjoy this type of content they just haven't found my channel just yet also for quick updates follow my instagram or my name there is true once with the number two and all my links, including the Instagram to get you to it quicker, is in the description box down below. And if I have any discount codes as well. But most importantly, what we are here at True Wants is a community where we share about the brands, the products, and of course the deals with spoilers on subscription boxes too. And I always look forward to seeing you in the comments where I do my best to respond to all. And I always appreciate when you watch in full, I'll be sharing some word that you'll be able to put in your comments. So I'll know that you did watch in full. And also if I've helped save you money or keep you informed, there's always that thanks button that is down below, which is very much appreciated as a channel to help it as well. So I appreciate when you use that thanks button right underneath this video as well. Now let's get started with today's video because this is always a special month because this is the icon month. So I have two paid for accounts, but we also got PR from Ipsy where I did individual videos for the glam bag, the boxy charm and the icon. For the BoxyCharm one, I will leave it down, down below because some of the items that I got in there, I think just one, is a duplicate for me. So the one that I got in this box will go into my gifts for later, but the swatching on that is going to be in the PR unboxing, but I'll show you everything in this video. But if you want to see swatches, that other video will give you other items that I got as well as the swatching on the palette that we're going to be going through in this video. Now this is the BoxyCharm box, which means it is five full-size items. We pay around $30 for it. My box in particular, this one, has a value of just under $200, but I also have the boost in here that is not part of that amount. For the boost, that is something I prepay $15 for, and I ended up choosing a different item, which we'll go through when we get to the boost area. But the one that I chose, I found out after, has a value of over $110, which is crazy, just for one product through the boost section. So let's get started with the first item that I have in this box. And that is the one that is the duplicate item that I'm going to put my, this one that I'm opening up. I made sure to make sure everything in it was in good condition and that will go into my gifts for later. So this is again from Siate London. It is called I Am Woman. It is a 24 shade eyeshadow palette and this one is in volume two. This is one of their newer launches. This on its own is a $45 item and this is obviously they also have, I shouldn't say obviously, this with BoxyCharm, they have where there's five full size items, they give two that are power picks. And they always say the power pick will more than pay for the value of the box. And then we still get to choose three items based on a selection that they give us. So this one here is like they mentioned the power pick. And this, of course, again, more than paid for the box. So this is a palette that is not only a stunning collection of eyeshadows, but it also is a heartfelt tribute to the unwavering spirit of women. It features 24 shades ranging from soft browns to nudes to buttery mauves. It also, they say, has intense metallics and it's all formulated with the brand's signature creamy formula. There's a mix and match the special effects from the metallics and the mattes that will give you that unique look. Now this brand, if you're not familiar, is a British brand and it is beloved for its on-trend, unexpected and innovative products. They're saying it has glow getting highlighters to setting sprays and more. And through their products, they aim to make beauty uncomplicated, attainable for all to be encouraging for everybody to be able to express themselves through makeup. And this is the actual outside box, but you'll see that the actual product itself has, it looks exactly the same. So here is some of the information that is on the back of the packaging. And as you can see, the print is very, very small. So hopefully you'll be able to spot a couple of the ingredients that are in here and then whatever information they wanted to share on the back of the packaging, you'll be able to see it all here. The other item here that is here, you'll see the other item. The other 
I'm sorry, my mind is all over the place because I almost didn't get this box today. There was a problem with the label and it was going back to the sender. And we ran in the car when we got that notification via email and we ran in the car and very nicely the post office, which is very far from where I live, were able to search it for it and find it. And the back of the label was almost completely blacked out by almost it looked like some marking and you wouldn't be able to read my address or anything. So that's why it was going to be going back. But uh, I'm very, very happy that we were on our emails early in the morning and that's when we got the notification. And so that's why I'm able to have it to show it to you guys today. If we wouldn't have ran over to our post office and if the post office wasn't willing to look for it, then I don't think I would have gotten this. It would have gone back to Ipsy uh, because the Ipsy address was clear. My address for some reason had some black that ran through the label that some of the tracking was not visible to scan as well as for sure my name and address you were only able to see um, at my my uh, zip code that was it so this is the one that we're going to be putting in the gifts for later as you can see it is not swatched but I will definitely show you the one that uh, we've already had the opportunity to swatch so I'm just going to put this back here and then we'll leave this good one here and then I will close it back up and again like I said we're going to put it into the gifts for later but I have the one that we already uh, swatched, so I'll be able to swatch a couple of these for you here in this video, but I'm only gonna do like one matte and one shimmer because I wanna definitely share the other products that we haven't seen yet. So what I found when we swatched the first row, a lot of these I found needed like almost like a double swatch, which I'll show you. This here, you can see it really nicely on my finger, but when I went to swatch it, oh, here it's showing okay, but you can see here, some of these needed to be built up. And then I'll do the other one that's a little bit darker right beside it. And then you'll see that here. So as you can see, that's not as vibrant. That was the one that I wanted to show you guys. That one's supposed to be the deeper one that is here. So some of I'm finding the mats with this Ciate London palette, because I never had a problem like this before, need to be built up. So what I'm expecting trying to explain is if you're getting this just know that but also don't think that all Ciate, Ciate London palettes are the same because I have never had this type of issue with any of my other palettes where it was almost like a little bit too beginner friendly so that is that but I want to also show you uh, the metallic so we're going to do a light one here so you can see it here and we'll just do it right over here and as you can see, it's not showing the vibrancy. So know that some of these are going to be more um, what I would call toppers. And then you can see this almost has like a duochrome to it as well. It's a very beautiful, unique palette. I started to play with it a little bit and I wanted to be able to give myself more time with it because see how gorgeous that one is? So what I'm saying is this is just a palette that it has a little bit of surprises in it. Don't get discouraged if some of the shadows are to me ones that need to be more buildable because as you can see the lighter one which should have been the problem isn't yet the darker one for the and I know with purples that's why I showed purples they always say the manufacturers or other you know makeup artists say that purple is always the hardest to know but also know that don't get discouraged when you see other ones that look more like a topper where the other ones are more vibrant. So they really have a lot of mixture of the consistency of what the product is going to be. But because I got this a little bit earlier, I had a chance to get my mind around it to be able to share it with you in this video. The next item is one that I've had in the past and it's one that I recommend as well. This is from Dr. Brent. This is the Pour No More. It's a luminizing primer. And I'm a combo girl and I still was able to enjoy this product. This also, I think, was a power pick and this is also a $40 value. Now, this one that says, if you're looking for the lit from within glow, you just found it. This is a lightweight primer that creates glowing, flawless complexion with or without makeup. It helps to blur the look of pores and imperfection and provides a smooth canvas for seamless long wear foundation application. They want us to smooth the primer over our clean, moisturized skin and then apply our makeup as usual, or as they mentioned, we can wear it alone. This is founded by a cosmetic dermatologist, and his name was his, yeah, was, because he's passed since creating this line. His name is Dr. Frederick Brandt, and it, he does cutting edge products with breaking the boundaries of any of the traditions, especially in skincare. So this is how it arrived. 
no outside box and there was no safety seal on this either but i'm going to do my best to put whatever information i can up to the camera here and with the reflecting packaging i don't know how much you'll be able to get from it but we always know because like i say i don't edit i film to the best of my ability and i really focus on the product so here we go so i'm going to squeeze a little bit here so you'll be able to see what the product actually looks like inside the tube and what i like about this is even though it says it gives luminosity and because i'm a combo girl we're always afraid when we hear that because we don't want to look more glowy than we can so that is what it looks like when you spread it out a little bit but i'm going to now take and put it like i would on my as if this was my whole face and as so i can show you how easily this goes in it feels very much like a lotion it doesn't have like a sticky like consistency to it it really feels like a luxurious to me lotion cream and then you can see here that it really just makes everything smoother but it doesn't give off this overly glowy glowy look just like a really beautiful almost as they girls say like lit from within type of look just very healthy looking compared to my other hand here so really beautiful really smoothing like i said i liked it because i like when you know these type of products don't give an over like highlight type of glow it really just gives this healthiness to the skin the next item is one that i'm also really excited that i got the opportunity in this box it is from a benefit cosmetics this is the pore professional good cleanup foam cleanser this is a 29 dollars value on its own this is going to be five ounces and it says if you have enlarged or visible pores you won't get them with this cleanser it helps to reduce the look of large pores with a lemon extract with antioxidant rich yuzu extract and it also has uh, some smoothing ingredients in here that will also brighten our complexion they want us to massage the cleanser over our skin in circular motions and then rinse with uh th thoroughly with warm water now about this brand it was founded by two sisters in san francisco and they're saying this is a quirky brand that puts the fun back into makeup without sacrificing any of the quality from the iconic packaging to the groundbreaking formulas they're saying that benefit cosmetics is beloved across the world for all these good reasons and also if you get the opportunity hsn does a lot with benefits and they have a lot of fantastic deals and i learned a lot more about this brand through those shopping channels because as i've mentioned in previous videos years ago it was such a great way to learn uh, so much about the products from the actual brand owners now the two sisters that they mentioned are you know who started this they both had daughters and those two daughters are now involved in the business and those are usually the people that are the spokesperson now and have been in the forefront of continuing the love for this brand so it came in this box completely sealed However, on the inside, when I opened it up, there was a couple of dents on my bottle, as you can see here, and on the back here. And then here, it didn't have an extra cover or a cap on it, but this has a click where you have to take it and click it to open it. And then when you do, I'll just put it back of my hands here. This is the first time that I'm gonna be pumping this, but I did get this, which a lot of us did, uh, if you had the opportunity in the sample size, which lasted me, like over a whole month where I used it day and night. So let me just show you the consistency of this product. I just got to prime it. And then you can see when it comes out, it has a almost like a liquidy formula to it. But as soon as, and I should have brought some water here, as soon as you start, um, uh, you know, getting water onto this, it will foam up. So it has... A beautiful scent to it also it is very lemony it is really really beautiful and it also doesn't strip your skin at all and i like gel cleansers but i also love when they foam up as well so very excited about this one my memory on this is when i pumped it it came out like a foam so this might be a different cleanser than the one that i had in the past or my memory is not as good as i think so i'm gonna have to play with this a little later the next item is one that I'm very excited about, and this is when you got to make sure that your beauty quiz is up to date because this they chose this color for me. This is the contour, and they're saying a highlight stick in shadow. But when we did our spoilers, we learned because I go to the website of the brand because like you, I'm a paying customer, and I want to know as much as I can prior to choice day. 
This has a $25 value and this is a contour stick. And the reason they call it the contour and highlight stick, they, this comes based on what our research showed us here when we went to the website in four shades. But one of the four shades was a banana shade, which would be one that you would use more like a highlighter. The other three were all different tones for the contour. Now this is a creamy complexion stick in the Ultimate Multitasker. The full pigment creamy formula effortlessly blends into your skin and leaves a natural looking matte finish. The shadow will be a cool contour shade that is for fair skin tones and perfect for sculpting. Now blend it onto the hollows of your cheek, your hairline, your jawline, the sides of your nose, the crease of your eyes, as well as your neck. And this is the brand that is founded by Anastasia and she has been the go-to beauty specialist for top celebrities for years and has single-handedly turned the perfect brows into those youthful eyes into the essential accessory. And it's so true. I learned about her also when at that time I was living in Canada and when I was there, uh, she was also on the shopping channel there. And it, the first kit that I ever bought from her was from that channel. And it's still one that I have to this day and I bought it in multiple. So I would have it in my travel bag as well. It was a kit that was all about her bra products as well as the stencils for the eyebrows. It was so exciting to be able to learn more about a brand, especially when we lived in Canada, that was uh, you know, one of the top brands in California. So it was always exciting to learn and have access to these brands. But now through Ipsy, we have so much access to this brand, it is amazing. And as you saw back here, the name of the one that I got is Shadow. So I think this one is one of the lighter shades and to me, it is that perfect uh, contour. And the contour should have a little bit of a gray undertone to it because that's giving you the structure to your face, whereas the um, bronzers will have more warmth. So I wanna make sure that I get this so the camera can pick it up there. And there you go. So that is what this looks like. Again, this I have uh, other products from them that are in these stick formulas that are just fantastic. And I'm so excited because I have contour and I do contour, but I've always done it with powder. I've only started getting into the creams because of the boxes. And as a combo girl, I've always stayed clear of it, but don't. If you get it, play. You have the opportunity, you know, at $30 a month to get where you get five full-size products. And even if you're on the fence about them, take the time to play with them. It really will change your whole attitude about makeup and what you thought was good for you or not good for you. So very excited about this. It's a creamy formula when it goes on, but it is not the type that is gonna go like um, greasy all over the skin. It really has a nice finish to it. And I'm very, very excited about it. So this is another one that I could not wait to get it in, in my box. And the next item that I had the opportunity to choose is because I've had in the past when BoxyCharm was not part of Ipsy to get this product. So this is gonna be another scent from them and I'm very excited about this because these are perfect to carry in your purse because these are also roller balls. Now this is this brand that is called Riddle Oil and the one brand that, the sorry, the scent that is in here is called Voyeur and this is a $58 value on its own and it is an eight mil. And they're saying this is a vanilla lover. This one will be for us. It is warm, inviting, and sweet. This fragrance is intoxicating and addictive. With notes of vanilla, amber, and sandalwood, it's sure to become a signature scent in no time. You apply the oil to the pulse points and gently rub it into your skin. Now to learn a little bit more about Riddle Oil, they're saying it is a luxury fragrance brand that is inspired to make people feel more confident through their scent. So it comes in this little box here, and this is the oils that are in here. Everything is on the back of the box. And then on the other side here, it tells you that this is a roll-on fragrance oil. There's the name Voyeur. And then here you have where it shows you it's made in the USA. And then I don't know if I showed this side of the box, so I'll just do it again. And this is this item here. So when I opened it up, I went to check and the scent that I have is not this scent. So I'm very excited about that. Here is the beautiful name on the bottle. I'm hoping the camera's picking everything up that I want to show you. And then again, there is some more information here. And then when you open it up, it has that rollerball in it. And it's also nice when it's a rollerball, you don't get that much that comes out. 
So this will last you a long time. And as you can see, I did a little bit before we sat down so I can know what the scent is. Now this is the second time I'm using it. And if this was a spray, you would have seen that it would have already gone down a little bit here. So very excited about this one. And the scent is that pure vanilla. It is a really, really soft scent that it's not going to be overpowering that, you know, sometimes you go into an elevator and you know somebody was in there with some perfume. This is the type that someone would have to get so close to you to be able to smell this. And it is just, it's just very inviting, but very soft and very gentle. The next item is here is going to be the Beauty Boost. Now the Beauty Boost this time, and they're not giving, the, last month and already this month, I did have a video that I was able to do last night that I got some sneak peeks through some friends on other platforms that have some inside connections to Ipsy. So I was able to give us a little bit of a heads up before the official spoilers come out, including the bag for the glam bag, which is really great. So if you haven't seen that video, I will try to leave that also linked down below. So I'll leave the BoxyCharm PR as well as the uh, unofficial spoilers because they're more official than un. But I always want to make sure that if it's not something I see on the Ipsy platforms, that's when I call it unofficial. So this is what I ended up choosing for myself because the Beauty Boost, they used to give us these great little hints on their Instagram and they didn't last month. And I thought maybe it was because it was an icon month and they were a little bit too busy. But I found this month, by this time of the month, I would have already seen something on their platform and I haven't seen anything yet. So I don't know if they're not giving hints anymore in reference to the Beauty Boost and we'll only see it when it becomes at the beginning of the month. But if I know something, you know that I will definitely share it with you guys. Excuse me. With that said, I want to make sure that you guys know that the Beauty Boost ends up being a fourth choice, but you have to prepay $15 for it. And I've been getting the Beauty Boost right at the beginning. So I have seen how they have made it even better and better. When I started with the Beauty Boost, you had no choice. It was that was what you got in your box and that was it. They have really made it a lot better that they made it a fourth selection in your box, but with higher end brands within that fourth choice. So this time around, the Beauty Boost that everybody could have gotten in their box if they didn't change their choice would have been from Fresh and it would have been a rose cream moisturizer. As you know, if you've been part of my channel, the rose scent is not something I enjoy in products, but I do enjoy them in my personal life, but just not in products. So when I had the opportunity to change it, I did in both of my, my uh, boxes because my Icon box will also get the Beauty Boost because it's an upgrade box. But I also, in this BoxyCharm box, of course, I have my Beauty Boost as well. And on this one, I ended up choosing from this brand, which has turned into a brand that I'm really, really enjoying. It's called By Rowey. And this is going to be their Pumpkin Pro Retinol Cream. Now, when I chose this, I did not know that it had a value of $110, which is crazy. Because I never choose by price, I really choose by product. But this is a moisturizer. They're saying it is a pumpkin powered wonder. It's exactly what your skincare routine has been missing. It features skin brightening pumpkin and high performance actives like the smoothing retinol. It also has firming bacterial and nourishing ceramides. Together, these ingredients will help replenish essential moisture, support collagen production and reduce the look of fine lines and wrinkles. They want us to spread a quarter size amount over our face and neck morning and night. Now about the brand, they're saying it performs extensive market research to ensure to develop products with a point of difference. I also know that we have learned from this brand that, uh, and I got introduced to this brand when it was part of BoxyCharm, before BoxyCharm was part of Ipsy, that they pretty much call themselves like a salad for your face. So there were so many fantastic products that we've had the opportunity to try from this brand. So when I saw an opportunity to try another one, I could not resist. And the packaging on this, as you can see, is just stunning. And you would expect it to be with it. And here it says, salad infused beauty. Oh, I'm hoping the camera's catching what I'm seeing. So this is just beautiful. It is really, really something. The packaging you can feel is very high end. It has that glossy finish to it. And when you open it up, it inside, it is just as beautiful. And then inside here, it has an extra little piece of 
uh, cardboard that will keep it secure in here. So everything about this screams high end and luxury, and we're able to get this if you're part of the Beauty Boost for just $15, which is unbelievable. It is a glass jar. It has a beautiful reflective gold lid. Their label on it is here. That is the only information that has the label. The other information on the back here just simply says Pumpkin Pro Retinol Cream. It is a very, very heavy jar. And when you open it up, it will have that inside safety seal, which I always keep because I help. I feel it helps with freshness. And then this is what the consistency looks there. There's a little bit on the back here, which I'm just gonna take my finger to, to see it in person and see the if the scent to it. I'm just gonna close this up quickly and then put it back up here. And then we will play with the cream formula that I just took out. So we'll just leave that up here as well. So this is what it looks like here. There is very little scent to it. I don't smell the pumpkin. So you'll have to tell me if you do. I'll see once we spread it on my hand if I do. I, I really don't smell the pumpkin at all. It almost has no scent to me whatsoever. And then this is the consistency of the product. Feels very luxurious, not heavy though. It does have that, this is the type that you'll need to give it time to sink into your skin, but it feels extremely luxurious to the skin and to the touch. So very, very excited about this. And this is really what I was so looking forward to in this box. So to me, this box was an absolute home run. I love everything that I got in here. It's always exciting when we get new products to have the opportunity to try, but also sometimes some old favorites that maybe you got it in the sample sizes. And when you had the opportunity to choose the full size, you already tried it and you knew that you wanted to have the full size of it. So very excited about all of these products. If you've already received your box, and you've had the opportunity to play, make sure to share it in the comments down below. Or if you are seeing them for the first time through this video, which one are you even more excited about getting when your box arrives? And that's it for this video. So if you've watched this all the way to the end, I appreciate it so much. I love that you like spending time here with me, but also learning more about the brands and the products because we always know with Ipsy, we get the deals. So this is going to be the, what you're going to leave in the comments is full size so that I know that you've watched this all the way to the end. And I also would love to know if you're liking that we're starting to see more perfumes in our boxes because I know I am. And that's it for this video. So take care, everybody. Continue to stay safe and well, and I'll see you all soon again in the next one. Bye for now.